One of the most innovative gaming streaming services is GeForce Now. Instead of offering gamers a catalog of titles for their monthly fee, users access their own library of games from third-party shops like Steam and Epic Game Store. And in today's video, I am going to show you the 10 best games on NVIDIA GeForce Now that you can try. So without any further ado, let's start this video. Number 1 We have Control. High quality reflections, diffused lighting, contact shadows, and more are supported by Control. For Remedy fans, it keeps much of the studio's themes in gameplay, making it a must-play. You play Jesse Fadden, a woman with a shape-shifting service weapon who must retake a secret government facility from the Hiss, a species of otherworldly entities. Number 2 We have The Witcher 3. The game gives you a plethora of chances to explore the game world outside the main route and meet all kinds of strange creatures and individuals. The expansive world of The Witcher 3 has thriving towns, war-torn bogs, deep woods, and vast cave systems for you to explore when you're not busy slaughtering formidable creatures. Number 3 We have Anno 1800 Anno 1800 takes place during the 19th century Industrial Revolution in two parallel civilizations, the Old World, where residents, laborers, and craftsmen produce, and the New World, where goods and trade routes dominate. Farmers leaving the countryside to work in busy cities as industrial workers and merchants are well shown in the game. Next up we have Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Streaming through GeForce now mitigates the performance difficulties that have been raised about Assassin's Creed titles on PC, particularly at launch. Additionally, each installment, including Assassin's Creed Odyssey, has included increasingly lifelike visuals. Next up we have Metro Exodus. When it comes to visuals, Metro Exodus is often considered one of the few really next-gen games for what that may be worth to PC players. Reasons for this include its groundbreaking use of ray tracing, its more engaging HUD design compared to earlier Metro games, its highly detailed weaponry and landscapes, and a host of other factors. Next up we have Dauntless. The hunt, craft, and repeat gameplay cycle that has attracted millions of players is presented in a condensed form in the game Dauntless, which was greatly influenced by the Monster Hunter series. It also offers crossplay, which lets you compete against other players alongside your buddies. Number 7 We have Far Cry 6. In the fictional land of Yara, you must overthrow a dictator who refuses to step down. Instead, grandiose set pieces, a rich array of weaponry, and fresh foes around every corner will continually push you ahead and make you think on your feet. Next up we have Weird West. In this top-down RPG, otherworldly animals and magical hijinks populate the Untamed West. With its isometric viewpoint, combat is tactical and fast-paced. You may use a range of powerful weapons and talents to kill the evil guys, or you can sneak past them. Next up we have Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy. Guardians of the Galaxy was Square Enix's comeback after Marvel's Avengers. The Game Awards 2021 awarded the game numerous prizes, including for its storytelling. You'll accompany Star-Lord and his ragtag crew as they strive to swindle money. The trip that follows is unlike any other game. The last game of this video is Dying Light 2 Stay Human. Dying Light 2 is finally out, and it doesn't disappoint. The sequel takes what you liked about the first and strips out the fluff. You'll climb rooftops, fight in melee, and navigate a city packed with foes. Its characters aren't great, but fans can ignore the tale for its great gameplay. So that's the list of 10 best games on NVIDIA GeForce Now to play in 2023. If you like the video and want to see more content from Cloud Plus Games, your subscription is much appreciated.